So hi, good day everyone. Today, I'll be presenting to you the results of the study. But first, let us observe the pictures I've presented. So it is me and my friends eating street foods, and that street foods will be our topic for today, because I will be discussing to you the results of what the researchers have gathered about the street food vending. So next thing is that tempura and fish ball. So I'll be presenting to you the result of the study street food vending for economic and social empowerment of women street food vendors in the Maguete City, Philippines. So here are the researchers. Choi G. Perez, Sami M. Kayat, Benilda P. Villanueva. And by the way, my name is Buhisan Animary L. So let's now start with our topic. I'll be discussing to you the different sections of the results in this study. First, the number of children schooling. This is the way and the data that the researchers gathered. So number two, the children's school level. Number three, the profits gained through street food, street food vending, I mean. Number four, ratings on nine indicators of economic empowerment. Number five, ratings on statement indicators of social empowerment. And these are all in the form of chart, charts and tables. I'm sorry. So, next thing. We now go with the first table, which is the number of children schooling. So, it is the first uh, data that the researchers have gathered. We now go with zero, which is 13.50%. None. And the number one, 35.10%. The next is 29.70%. The next three, 12.20%, four, 8.10%, and the number five is 1.40%. So that's it. We now proceed to the second. The second table is all about the children's school level. So in here, you can see that uh, those students that are not studying yet is 15% in the kinder, 11.20%, the elementary, 15.15%, 15 .15%, I mean, high school, 13.80%, the college, which got the highest, is 22.50%. 6.20% college and high school, 5.5% 5 .5 college and elementary, 6.20% high school and elementary, 3.80% college and high school and elementary, 1.20% college and elementary and kinder or prep. And Next, th the third table. So in here, at table 3 shows profits gained through street food vending. We got 12.60% for those who get 100% profit out of 20%. Next is 16.80% for those who got at least 75% profit. And... 31.60% for those who got at least 50% profit. Profit. And 26.30% for those who get at least 25% profit. And last is 12.60% for only who get below 25% profit. So we all know that uh, street food vending is really more relevant in the Damagari city as we know we are both by in that area especially newer college students 
and we are. Next step is this is with regards to the ratings on nine statement indicators of economic empowerment. Getting the highest mean value was the statement indicator. I can buy more healthy food for the family for better, better health and communication. The mean of 4.46 was strongly agreed. So, table 4 shows the rest of the ratings on statement indicators of economic empowerment. First, we got 3.75 to agree. 4.35 strongly agree. 4.46 strongly agree. 3.42 to agree. And agree of 4.11. Agree of 3.66. Agree of 4.16. Agree of 4.16. So we now go with the last table. I mean, there is still agree of. 4.3. So we do now go with the last table. So table 5 shows the rest of the respondents' ratings and statement indicators of social empowerment. You can see I mean, the highest in here is strongly agree, which is 4.95. We is it? Yes. We agree of 3.76, agree of 3.98, agree of 3.26, neutral 2.91, strong agree of 4.22, agree of 3.9, and agree of 3.99. So those were all the results that the researchers have gathered. So now, we now go with the last slide, which is... Your applications. So in here, oh, it's reverse. So in here, the researchers insight in the interview researchers learn that the respondents were responsible for making decisions to engage in selling street food items. So that's what they have implicated that there's that the respondents were responsible for making decisions to engage in selling street food items. It's their own intention. Next is the woman's reasons in engaging vending. Vending them. That's its vending. It is first to help the family, to have extra money for raising child's education, to have free meals, and last is the only option for a living. So this is my preference, and this is me eating street food. So that will be all. Thank you.